Hey everyone, welcome back to Joystick News. Today we've got a hot topic that's sure to stir up some major discussion Call of Duty. Black Ops 6 is breaking away from a long-running tradition and it's already got fans talking. Whether you're a die-hard COD fan or just curious about what's next for the franchise, this is something you won't want to miss. So let's dive right into it. If you've been following Call of Duty for a while, you know that multiplayer has always been the centerpiece of every game's reveal. Zombies mode, it's usually the side dish, something we get a glimpse of after the main course. But with Black Ops 6, Treyarch is flipping the script. They're putting zombies front and center, even before we've had a proper look at the multiplayer. Yep, you heard that right, Zombies is taking the spotlight this time around. Now, why is this such a big deal? Well, for starters, Zombies has always been a fan favorite mode, but it's never been the headliner. By giving it the spotlight early on, Treyarch is making a bold statement. This year, Zombies is not just an add-on, it's a core part of the Black Ops 6 experience. And judging by the early footage we've seen, it looks like they're going all out to make it the best Zombies mode yet. We've already gotten a sneak peek at one of the launch maps, Terminus, and it's packed with new mechanics and features that are sure to shake things up. For example, solo players can now save and quit mid-game and pick up right where they left off. That's a game changer for anyone who's had to ditch a session halfway through because, you know, life happens. Plus, they're bringing back Gobblegum, but this time you won't need any in-game currency to get it. Instead, you'll unlock it randomly at the end of each round, which adds a fresh twist to the gameplay. But here's the kicker, this isn't just a one-off. Treyarch seems to be hinting that Zombies is going to play a much bigger role in the future of Call of Duty. With Black Ops 6, they're not just changing the way they reveal content, they're potentially setting the stage for Zombies to be on equal footing with multiplayer or maybe even more prominent. Of course, we still have the Call of Duty next event coming up, where we'll finally get to see what's in store for the multiplayer mode. But even then, zombies won't be stepping back. They're planning to reveal the second launch map, Liberty Falls, right after the multiplayer showcase, which just goes to show how much emphasis they're putting on this mode. So what does this mean for the future of Call of Duty? Are we seeing the start of a new era where zombies could take the lead? Or is this just a one-time experiment? Either way, it's clear that Treyarch is taking some big risks with Black Ops 6, and it's going to be fascinating to see how fans react. What do you all think? Is Treyarch making the right move by shaking up the tradition, or should they have stuck to the tried and true formula? Drop your thoughts in the comments below and let's get the conversation started. And don't forget to hit that like button if you're as hyped as we are for Black Ops 6 and subscribe for more updates on all things gaming. Until next time, keep gaming and we'll catch you in the next video.